flows or gaze the weaving of life force within the basic purpose of male female relation is fulfillment in life fulfillment becomes the beginning for transcendence indeed an all encompassing fulfillment sets the process of transformation in motion which ultimately leads to transcendence beyond body mind realm this interaction through sexual interplay gives fulfillment to both partners once both are fulfilled at sex level other fulfillments become not only less important instead irrelevant as well therefore the focus should remain on sexual fulfillment when sexual interplay leads to fulfillment then sex reaches a spiritual dimensions orgasms are most commonly caused by life force or pranavayu flowing within these mostly happen on the surface of the body created by the friction between life force within and fluid energy on the surface as life force flows across the surface of the body the continual play of energy within creates a wave of orgasm these types of orgasmic waves usually occur because of total freedom spontaneity and being natural in life and living if you are not natural and spontaneous you can only pretend to be natural and spontaneous during sex without being natural spontaneous and free sex cannot take one to the deepest core of the being orgasmic waves transmit energy and are commonly caused by the life force as it flows across the body these orgasmic waves are ca- caused by the gravitational pull of moon the female energy and sun the male energies one may notice at times orgasm is very intense while other times mild these all happen because of the interaction between moon and sun energy the male and female energy flowing within at the moment the ebb and flow of orgasm that we experience at different times are due to the life force of our inner ocean of the being the gravitational pull of the moon and the sun the male female energies flowing within on the body causes orgasmic waves of varying magnitudes these orgasmic waves can be breaking apart constructive deep destructive intense and internal at emotional plane as well or orgasmic waves can be categorized differently based on their formation and behavior breaking waves are formed when they collapse on themselves constructive waves are created on the surface with low wavelength and heights these 
have long lasting deeper effect on one's fulfillment level while destructive orgasmic waves are similar in nature but have a wavelength with a vertical ellipsis in grammar meaning three dots indicating something important is missing when the destructive wave means they are similar in nature but have a wavelength with vertical ellipsis ellipsis is the word that means in grammar three dots after in a sentence after a word meaning that something important is missing these can create or maintain in a conflict or conflict between couples this is the nature of destructive waves deeper orgasmic waves are long straight and travel great distance on the surface in this the orgasm is spread all over the body to far corners and its effect is deep and long lasting each cell of the body feels such intense orgasmic wave such orgasmic waves ultimately pave the way for enlightenment internal waves are high and turbulent currents that are produced by meeting of two fluid energies within these orgasmic waves are specific to the emotional layer formed when there is a lack of life force however these create high and wide orgasmic waves that are warmer in their nature these provide emotional fulfillment sometimes the orgasmic waves move at a great speed and can be split into two capillary waves and orbital progressive waves is still there are refracted waves that are created when the energy is shallow they or we can say the interest in any of the partner is shallow or less at that moment the depth decreases the waves power and forms a curve shape the energy that flows from the earth center upwards passes through various psycho centers operating at physical emotional and energy layers the three layers of energy frozen fluid and vapors in the process of any interaction between objects and beings male and female first of all have the frozen energy that has to melt to become fluid like horizontal movement is possible only when energy becomes fluid like because when it is flowing only then it can move horizontally parallel to the earth's surface this horizontal movement can take you not too far along the path for transformation this fluid must become vapors or gas gaseous then it can merge into cosmic energy ice remains at one place and when it is consciously begins to melt then it begins to flow according to 
the the from a higher altitude to the lower but when it becomes gaseous because of the heat then its vertical movement begins because of this orgasm can happen at three planes physical emotional and energy planes really all orgasms happen at physical plane alone when the orgasmic waves are intense these reach the emotional layer this brings emotional fulfillment such emotional fulfillment is very necessary for life's journey there is direct connection between orgasm and fulfillment sex can give both good and bad experiences but no experience can bring fulfillment when orgasmic waves are much deeper and these waves reach the emotional layer one feels emotional maturity Ful fulfillment is bound to happen lastly the deepest layer energy is in gaseous form at this plane individual energy merges with cosmic layer this is the inner shore of enlightenment while the other shore happens on its own between these inner and outer or near and far shores is life and living as river bed where consciousness flows between these inner and outer or near and far shores is life and living as river bed these two shores far and near between them life and your life and living becomes the river bed where consciousness flows that guides just as there are two shores of the river and between these two the water flows so consciousness flows in the bed that is known as that is formed with life and living compassion flows as the fragrance of love indeed these are three doors to existence physical emotional and energy in order to reach the deepest core of one's being one need to have free movement as a result during each male and female interaction orgasmic waves arise at the level of the body physical plane these can reach the second door and when crosses the second door uh, one attains emotional maturity and the waves reach the last or the third door fulfillment is total at the level of at the level of transcendence beyond finite happens enough for now